here today at Studio X in Seattle, Washington on Capitol Hill. We've done a number of movies, video games. With Mr. Holland's Opus and Die Hard. Scored The Revenant, or Ryuchi Sakamoto. Records for R.E.M., Soundgarden, Pearl Jam's regular customer, Dave Matthews, great guy to have around. Four different Halo video games. Batman Arkham. Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless Mind. Ang Lee on Brokeback Mountain. It's a real joy to work with the same musicians that we've been working with. So today we're recording a wonderful score with the composer, Hannah Parrott. It's extremely compelling, it's emotional, it can be understated and full of gravitas. It was really great being able to work with Hannah Parrott, our composer. She was bringing us to places with music we can't go and experience. Something that people talk about in the near the experience is that the music in heaven was unlike anything they've ever heard here on earth. And so it's like, how do you make a song about that? First, I had to say that I was never going to accomplish that because I believe it's going to be otherworldly and the best thing ever. And I know I'm not going to accomplish that, but what would be my best attempt? Music writing always feels kind of supernatural because you write something and then you don't know how it was written and it just kind of happened. <laughs> I was just meditating on things that I that give life to my soul. How did it sound in the room? I was constantly surprised at how easily the music came. That aspect just felt like a gift. So this film is a very intimate film. And because of that, Hannah chose an orchestra that's entirely strings. And I love writing for strings, so I knew they were going to be a vital part of some of the most beautiful sounds on planet Earth. The, the music Hannah composed for this was just spot on. I thought it was lovely. It's always super great hearing real people play the music because they bring all their expertise and their emotion and their phrasing and their individuality to what I wrote and it brings it to life and it gives it warmth and depth. I, I like that. You know, it's a and so we're in a wonderful facility here. It has a sense of warmth that takes the wood of the string instruments and magnifies it. It lends the mystery and the components of the unknown meeting the known and interacting between the two of them that this film is all about. Today, we were, when we were working on the score for After Death, the, the visuals, it was the finest print I've ever seen, as it were. I'm real excited to see it. I found the visuals so mesmerizing. It opens up so many possibilities musically where you can have these very cosmic, cinematic, gigantic music moments that also can go down to intimate moments in the same scene because of how the visuals are. I was so moved by the stories of the individuals in it. I find so much purpose and hope in my own life through knowing that life is bigger than what we're experiencing right now. World-class people, right? Composer Hannah Parrott, and then the orchestra that she'll end up using to bring the sonic world to life. The best players in Seattle are bringing this music to life. Give it up for Hannah. Was there ever a point where you were like, what am I doing? Do I know what I'm doing? How do I do well, it? Well, thankfully, the timelines on some of these things don't really allow for that sort of like, <laughs> oh, I don't know. We know I how that know. goes. We just have to do it. And thankfully, I have wonderful collaborators. Everybody that came, Jason, Steven, Jens, were fabulous to work with. I worked with Steven Gray. I cannot speak highly enough of how generous he was as a collaborator and kind and encouraging. Whatever notes and interactions we had about adjusting things, they made it better like qualitatively better. Like it was such a great team. It just felt like more than a film. Super people, they're totally into their projects as we are. So the last two days have been delightful for me. And it's all come to this point and everybody is in the same room together and there's so much love and excitement. Everybody breathes together and at the end, it's magical. <laughs>